archives of the United States Cavalry, the true stories of Colonel Randall McKenzie and the cavalrymen he led, McKenzie's Raiders, his secret orders from the President of the United States, clean up the Southwest, make it a fit place for Americans to live, wipe out the renegades, outlaws, and murderers. If necessary, cross the Rio Grande, knowing capture means hanging by the enemy. Discovery, court-martial by the United States Army. September 1875, a few miles across the Rio Grande. Mackenzie and his raiders, again under secret orders, had crossed the border. The mission, wipe out Val Carter, who had left a sensational trail of blood and violence in central Texas. They can't be here, Val. They ain't allowed on this territory. They're here just the same. What about the law? I don't think those bullets know anything about the laws. Well placed, sir. Just so they're pinned. We've lost our surprise, but we'll still have it out with them. We will, that is, if a Mexican border patrol doesn't show up. Simpson. Yes, sir. There's a hole up there on their left. See if you can circle around and get into it. Right, sir. Cover him. Mackenzie's surprise attack had failed. Though Carter was now pinned down, both sides risked discovery by the Mexican border patrol. Aware of this risk, Mackenzie attempted to encircle Carter to finish him quickly. Hold tight here, Lieutenant. Right, sir. Peterson, come with me. Got a scatter. Rendezvous this side of the river. Mackenzie's leaving with one less than he came in with. I want him alive. Start looking. Where's Simpson? He hasn't shown up, sir. He must have been hit. He'll make it back if he's alive. We haven't much time, sir. I can't take a chance on Simpson being captured. We'll have to go back for him. But, sir, the border patrol. You're right, but we haven't much time, Lieutenant. Let's go. That's the last of them, sir. We won't have to worry about the border patrol. Good. <laughs> Lieutenant, have the men search this area. Check every inch of this terrain. It's quiet, sir. Carter must have moved on. Look here. It's blood. There's no trail leading away from here. Maybe Carter already has him. Or maybe Simpson slipped away. He knows how to cover a trail. And he left this marker for us. <laughs> Simpson's horse, sir. Yeah. I've got to know if Simpson's alive or not. But with these border patrols in the area, I can't operate with this many men. Have the raiders go back to the fort, then you and I will reconnoiter together. Yes, sir. for the night. Are we risking quite a lot, sir, staying on this side of the river? I bet we are, Lieutenant. We're risking everything. But we have no choice. If Simpson is captured by Carter. It might well mean the end of all our raids into Mexico. Well, we might not be able to prevent that, sir. As long as there's a chance, we've got to keep trying. Make yourself comfortable, Tom. 
If Simpson isn't caught, he still might make it back on his own. He's been well trained. Yeah, but unfortunately, he wasn't trained with a bullet in his body. When a man has to fight both fatigue and pain, you can't depend on his wit or his resistance. Simpson's gonna need both. Here. Wad that up, you can use it for a pillow. Well, what about you, sir? Never use them. Still, even if Carter does capture Simpson, there's no proof he was ordered here as a soldier. He'd swear to Carter or anybody else he was a deserter. Yeah, maybe so, but I can't depend on it. I can't risk our whole operation here in the Southwest on the ability of one wounded man to resist. Strange as it may seem, Tom, Simpson is now our enemy. Till he's either back in our hands or dead. What do you think Carter will do to him, sir? Anything he has to to smash me and the Raiders. He can turn him over to the Mexican government or he can turn him over to the American government. The storm that follows will wipe out the Raiders. I hate to think it, sir. We're better off finding Simpson dead than with Carter. Get some sleep, Lieutenant. You live here alone? Vive aquí solamente? Sí. It's all right. Me permite, por favor. Se quiere acostar.
¿Cómo se llama? Esperanza. ¿Y usted? Mi ama. I know I wing that man. No horse. Bleeding like a stuck pig. <laughs> Ain't even left a trail. Gotta give that McKenzie credit. He's got a tough bunch. Ah, uh, maybe not so tough, just smart. We'll find out how smart he is. As soon as I get my hands on him. But it better be soon. We're doing the best we can. Yeah, well, your best is nothing. Nothing. We get that raider here. Kenzie's already put a crimp in our operation just being here in Mexico. Yeah, that raider is my one chance to get McKenzie out of my hair for good and for all. If he's human, we'll find him. Ain't no way he can get out of the area. Perhaps he can swallow himself up in the air. Well, what did you find out? Well, we didn't find hiding a hair of that raider. I didn't expect you would. But we did find Colonel McKenzie himself. McKenzie? That's right. Here in the area, searching for that raider, same as we are. I left one of the men to trail him. <laughs> oh, this is better than I expected. Sure, McKenzie will get that man of his. And we'll be right there to pick them both up. Morning of the second day, deep in Mexican territory. Mackenzie and Lieutenant Paxson continued their desperate search for the lost raider. More than a man's life was involved, the very existence of the raiders, of Colonel Mackenzie himself, depended upon the recovery of Trooper Simpson. Stay right where you are, Lieutenant. I'm being followed by one of Carter's men. You better get out of here, Colonel. Yeah, I know. But I also know that Simpson's alive. I picked up his markers. They're pointed west. He can't have gotten very far from here. What about Carter? I'll circle around, then come back and continue to follow Simpson's markers. But when we do find Simpson, our work is really cut out for us. He won't be in any condition to travel by himself. You'll have to get the raiders to help us get out of Mexico. Well, I can get out of here without being seen. Once you find Simpson, what happens then? I'll get him back to this spot somehow. Meet me here with the raiders. Ride hard, Lieutenant. Sí. ¿Qué quiere? 
Got any strange Americans around here? No, no English. Take a look myself. You live here alone? Uh, Viva Sola? Si. Mi familia está muerta. Es su amigo, su amigo. Simpson, Simpson, good boy, Simpson. Thanks to her, it's clean. Bleeding's just about stopped. Agua para coronar. I see. Does she understand English? No, sir. How much does she know? Only what she sees. Her trousers. She knows we're soldiers. Does she live here alone? Her family died of typhoid a few months back. Senor. Oh. Which is gracias. De nada. Sir, I'm not so sure I covered my trail very well. I was pretty much out of my head most of the time. You did fine, fine. Those markers helped. Now tell me, Simpson, can you walk out of here? I don't know, sir. I had a pretty rough time just making it to that back door when Carter's men got here. Now listen to me. You've got to walk out of here. I can't let them capture you. You understand, Simpson? I know, sir. But I don't think I'm going to be able to make it back to the river. You won't have to go that far. I've sent Lieutenant Paxson back for the raiders. But we've at least got to get as far as the spot where he last saw me. And we've got to hurry. Now that Carter knows we're both in the neighborhood, he won't stop searching this area till he finds one or the other of us. Now, come on, come on. Senorita, por favor. Ay, pero se un enfermo, no, por favor. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Get out of sight. Come on. They're coming back. Senorita, parece aquí. I think I'll take another look, senorita. Oh, don't be afraid of me. Roman? Roman? Thank you, senorita. All right, Simpson. The two horses out in front, you ride one, the senorita and I'll ride double on the other. Come well, on, let's get out of here. Lieutenant Paxson and bring the raiders. It's our only chance. Don't worry, Colonel. They won't take me. Is there another way out of here? Hay otra salida. It's impossible. Hay otra salida. 
Sí, por aquí. You and the girl keep up a steady fire. Don't let them get near. Yes, sir. Good luck. Private Simpson reporting, sir. Oh, yes, Simpson. Uh, close the door. Step over here, please. Doctor tells me you're about ready to resume active duty. I'm ready to go back right now, sir. Mm -hmm. Well, I called you in here, Simpson, to remind you that when you became a raider, you took a certain oath never to divulge any of your activities as a raider, even after your term of enlistment is over and you've left the Army. But I haven't talked, sir. I don't intend to. See to it that you don't. 